Hi there, welcome to Bite Size Piano. In this video I'm going to teach you how to play Let It Be by The Beatles. So there's only going to be three sections that we're going to go through today which will make up the entire song. So like in all my videos, I've listed the full chord song lyric structure in the description below so you can follow it along and piece it together. So I'm going to start with the intro first which is pretty much the same as the verses. So the first chord we're going to play is a C major inversion which is G, C and E and you're going to play that twice and you're going to keep your thumb there and bring these notes in to B and D and play G major I'm going to play that twice and you're going to move that whole shape up one which is an A minor chord so A, C and E and you're going to play that twice And the next chord is an F major 7 to an F6. In the left hand you're going to play an F, but in the right hand you're going to play, effectively play an A minor chord again once, and then bring the E into the D. So with the left hand, when we come to do that in a moment, it will sound like this. And then it goes back to the C major chord again twice, and then back to G twice and then you're going to play these, this thirds pattern which is F and A, E and G, D and F and then C and E like this. So I'll just run through that right hand, those right hand chords again from the beginning. So the left hand, you're just going to be following all those root notes. So if you can play in octaves, play in octaves, but if not, just play a single lower note. So we've got C's. And then you could do this walk up, which is F, F sharp, G, or like that. But if you don't want to add that quick part in, after you've played the C, just go straight to the G. And then it's to A, and then to F, C, walk up, and then if you come up to F this time, you're going to play F, E, D, C. So I'm going to fit that together now, slowly. So that's the intro, and now those are the exact same chords for the verse, um, but the verse doesn't have that walk up part in it. So the verse, if I just play that for you, would just be. So now we're going to have a look at the chorus. So the first chord is an A minor, you're going to play that twice. And then a C major inversion again, so just move your thumb to G and play that twice. And then an F major chord twice, which is F, A and C. And then back to C major twice. C major again twice. G major and then this part again. I'll go over that one more time. So the left hand with that you're going to play 
A, and then down to a G with that C major chord. So that's going to be a C over a G, and then down to an F, and then a C, C again, and then G, and then F, E, D, C. So I'll fit that chorus together. So there's only one more part left to do, which makes the outro um, and is also part of the middle eight section which comes straight after the second chorus. So it's like an extension of this part. So you're going to play that, so the... And you're going to just keep going down in thirds. So the next one after that would be B flat and D, A and C, G and B, F and A, and then E and G. I'll do that again. And then there's like a little whirl, it's a sound which plays the same thing again but an octave higher. And the left hand is just following. Um, the bottom note more often than not, so it's playing F, E, D, C, B flat, A, G, F, and then very low C's. So I'll put that together. Um, and then it's like the guitar solo part, so um, the chords um, in the piano are just playing the chords in the verse again. So I'm just going to play the second chorus so you can see how it connects together with the, those, that middle eight third section. And again, that's how the piece ends as well. So that concludes um, the piano part to um, Let It Be. I hope that's been useful and that you have enjoyed it. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you have. If you have any song requests, please leave them in the comment section below. All requests are noted and considered. I look forward to talking with you all there and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.